Welcome back to my channel. My name is Kumbi. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. In today's video, we are going to be doing a Thrive Market unboxing haul, and then we're going to make some pasta, some keto approved pasta. Um, so let's get to it. So we have our box, our pretty decent sized box. I'm gonna go ahead and open it. Um, I ordered a few teens. I, I, the one thing that I ordered is pasta because I wanted to see how keto pasta tasted. What does it say? Aw, packed with love by Angel. Thank you, Angel. We appreciate you. Comes with a lot of packing. Okay, the first thing that I'm seeing that I'm really, really excited for um, are these. <laughs> My mom's in the corner and she's walking me. She's watching me, not walking me. Okay, but let's be serious. Um, I'm excited for these. These are the pork rinds, cinnamon churro inspired seasoning. So I'm really excited to try these out. This is how they look. The second thing, Let's see, this seems heavy. I think this is the pasta sauce. Oh, it's the pesto. Okay. All right. Okay. So, there's like a big Ziploc bag. Oh, I got a little stain thing. I got almond butter. It feels squishy. It feels um, a bit watery. But I got some almond butter. I wanted it in the little squeezy tube because I thought that this would be like easier to use. Um, it is, let's see. Oh, maybe it's not keto. Is it keto? I don't know. It was underneath the keto tab, so I purchased it. Something else that I did get is this Better Half Hazelnut Coconut Cream and Almond for my coffee. Um, it's really hard to find a keto coffee creamer, um, so I decided to get this. No sugars added. It came in two, so that's cool. I hope I like it. If not, that's awkward. And then I got some... I'm not excited for this. Ew. Okay. These are the Wonder Noodles. These are the Fettuccine Noodles. This is how they look. It don't look exciting. What does it look like, Mama? Mm. This is pasta. Oh, gosh. Is it wet? Yeah. I thought this was gonna be dry, but it's not dry. No cooking required, just drain. Just drain, rinse thoroughly, and eat. Like I'm hot, microwave them. I thought this was gonna be like, well, we'll see how this tastes. And then um, I also got these almond flour cookies. I honestly don't know if these were in the keto tab. I really just wanted cookies. So I got these ones. Um, me and my mom will try them together. Why not? So, like I said, I thought the pasta was going to be like, Real pasta, it's fake pasta, so that's awkward. I got this marinara sauce or tomato sauce for the pasta. Can I even use it? I have no clue. I hope I can. Uh, but this is the original, or hmm, not original, organic to skin pepper. Pepper, that sounds, I'm, I'm really having trouble talking because my whole family is here. Oh, all right, um, and then the last thing that I did get is pesto because I love pesto in my pasta. I'm very, very disappointed that this is how this pasta is looking right now. But I got some pesto, nothing serious, all right? So this is what I got. And I think in total, all of this was like 23 or $24. There's no receipt in here, so I can't tell you. But it was like 23 or $24. Let us try some of it. Um, and I will let y'all know how it tastes. Okay, mama, how does this pasta look to you? Ooh. Would you eat this if I made it? No. Okay. Guys, this looks... 
I would rather just not have pasta if this is what pasta is on keto, to be honest. I'd rather just cut it off. So we are going to try out these Simply Mills cookies. But I really likes chocolate chip cookies, so. And I don't Ooh. think there's like an aftertaste. <laughs> there's no aftertaste, it just tastes like a normal cookie. That's good. You wanna try this? What's that? Pork rind? Mm-mm. You wanna try it? Hans, you have to try the pork rind. You like super salty? Hmm? I don't like super mm. salty. Mm-mm. They're actually good. Mm-mm. Crunchy. Try it, Fuzzy. Ooh, Fuzzy got her friends calling. Can you try it? It's not bad. There's not a lot of um, the cinnamon part. It's not a lot of it. No, it's not. You don't eat pork rinds on a normal. It's honestly not bad. What is up friends? We are about to try this beauty of fettuccine noodles. I am scared. This is how it looks. It's still, like even after I washed them, they still smelled a bit fishy, but what can we do? You put some more meat and cheese on there. Truly speaking, I can't even taste anything. It just tastes like I'm eating gummies. Like chewable gummies. It tastes like I'm eating tasteless gummies. But it's not bad. Would I prefer the actual pasta? Yep. I would. But this is not bad. It tastes like nothing, honestly. Oh, hot. It tastes like water. Basically, imagine eating like gummies that have no flavor. A little water-ish. This is what it is. But if you make like bomb, what is it called? The sauce and the mincemeat. The sauce is really good too. It's, it has a bit of spice, which is good. But also remember, I seasoned it. But it's good, it's not bad. I was actually really scared. I didn't think I was gonna be able to finish them. Um, I thought I was just gonna like take a bite. But I enjoy it. If you are in keto, you're looking for noodles that are really low carb, um, go ahead and try these. These are good, they're not bad. Um, all right guys, so I am gonna talk to you guys a little bit more about Thrive Market. I'm gonna tell you guys the pros and the cons for me. Um, I signed up for Thrive Market about two months ago. I was not aware that Thrive Market is a subscription program. So they charge you $9 and some change every single month or there's a yearly membership that is an amount that I don't know. Um, I will go ahead and put it somewhere here to let you guys know. I was not aware that it was a monthly program and I waited a long time before I ordered my food. And then I saw that I was charged again and I was like, wait a minute, you guys are monthly? Um, so after I was charged the second time, that's when I decided to go ahead and order from them. So I ordered it on the 23rd of August and I think it got here on Friday the 25th. So it took about five days for the, um, the stuff to get here, which is honestly okay. It didn't take too long. Um, and I ordered nine things. Um, I ordered the pork rinds, the 
coffee cream coffee creamer i ordered the uh pesto the pasta sauce the noodles the chocolate chips and the almond butter um let's go ahead and review each item the pork rinds were good i have not tried the half and uh, the what is it called the coffee um the coffee creamer so i cannot tell you if it was good or not the basil did not try it so i cannot tell you if it was good or not and the the pasta sauce was actually really good i see myself ordering like that in bulk before this subscription thing ends um the noodles tasted like nothing to me um the biggest con for the noodles is that they smelled like fish man they smell like like fish you know when they say you are what you eat Let me tell you something, I used the bathroom, I went to pee and I could smell it. I could smell the fishy part and I was just like, I don't know if this is something I wanna eat again um, because that ain't a, that ain't a fresh scent, man. That ain't a fresh scent. The cookies were really good. My mom, my brother liked the cookies and then the almond butter was really good. Um, it tasted like almond butter to me so I really liked it. Another positive thing about this is that I like the fact that you can section off your foods. There's keto, gluten-free, paleo, raw, vegan, vegetarian. I think there's like a few more on there. I like the fact that you can go on the website and you can choose like I want keto foods only and you'll be able to get all your keto foods. I want vegan food only and you'll be able to get all your vegan. I like that. It makes it easier for someone who doesn't know how to start keto, who doesn't know how to start a low-carb diet, who doesn't know you know a lot like me um so i really really do like that the one thing that i do not like this is probably like the biggest well actually the two things i don't like the fact that it's a subscription i'm not one who likes to have a lot of subscriptions because i don't want a subscription to shop for my groceries basically um but i understand the concept i understand why it's a subscription but i'm not a fan of that um and then the second thing is that some of the things you have to get in twos, um, like the noodles, I had to get in twos. The coffee creamer, I had to get in twos. There was a lot of things that were in my cart that you had to get in twos, and I took it out because I was like, I don't know if I'm going to like this, and it doesn't make sense for me to spend seven to ten bucks or fifteen or twenty dollars on something that I don't know that I'm gonna like. And I don't really, well, I like returning things. Um, I don't mind returning things, but I wasn't really like, I'm not in the mood to be going to the post office. Let's return, let's do this. So that's why my tr my items were like, I didn't get that much because I didn't want to have to return things that, look. I didn't want to have to return food, basically. Um, but other than that, I did enjoy it. Like, I did like the food. I did like the pasta that I ended up cooking. Like I said, it didn't taste like anything to me. I liked the cookies. Will I be ordering again? Definitely, I will be ordering again. Um, if you guys want to order from there, I will put, I, I will put like a little uh, coupon code. Something else that I did like is that there is a code. Um, if I share my code with you and you use my code to sign up for your account, um, I get $10 to buy my groceries. So I really like that and I'm gonna make everybody in my family sign up so I can get $10 so I can get my sauce. What it do? And if you wanna use the code too, it's gonna be at the bottom or in this description bar. Um, but yeah. That is my Thrive Market review. Have you tried Thrive Market? If you have, please let me know what you think, what you like, the foods that I should try out when I go shopping at thrivemarket.com again. Um, yeah. So I know on my channel I have a lot of people that are doing keto, low carb, that are focusing on their weight loss journey. So I wanted to take this moment to first say thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. Thank you so much for all the lovely comments. Thank you so much for everybody that is in the comments uplifting me, telling me I can do it, I can work out. And thank you for everybody who's just like joining the journey with me. I really appreciate it and it makes it so much easier for me because I can wake up and say, you know what, there's someone else that is motivating me that's looking forward to me to motivating them, you know? So I know that there's a lot of people also that are on keto, low carb, um, and I thought, why not give one of y'all the opportunity to try Thrive Market for yourself and let me know what you think and what you buy. So, bum ba da -da! I will be giving away $50 to Thrive Market. Um, to join the giveaway, all you have to do is be subscribed to my channel, duh, like the video, comment down below what you would like to try from Thrive Market, um, and follow me on my Instagram. That is honestly it. 
on how to join the giveaway i don't know i'm running out of words and then this person doing the grrr is like distracting me so i'm gonna end this video here please join the giveaway please do like please 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 with the smiley face on top join the giveaway um but i hope you guys enjoyed this video um don't forget to like comment and subscribe and come back on thursday so you can know who wins the giveaway hey all right guys thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it toodaloo bye